Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve the USB 80236.SYS blue screen error you are experiencing on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this error is typically associated with USB ports on your computer. And the stop code error reads that it attempted to write to read only memory. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, type in device manager. Best result should come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. You want to double click on the universal serial bus controller section. And then you want to right click on the USB root hub USB 3.0 selection here. And select versus uninstall device. It's going to say warning, you're about to uninstall this device from your computer. Select uninstall. And then once that's done, go ahead and close out of here. And then you want to restart your computer and then it will automatically reinstall that device. And then hopefully at this point your issue has been resolved. If you're still having an issue, something else we can try here as well. Open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, should come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, go ahead and type in SFC, followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so you can see Windows Resource Protection did find corrupt files and successfully repaired them. So at this point, you want to go ahead and close out of here, and you want to restart your computer. So there you go, guys. Pretty straightforward process. Hopefully I was able to help resolve the issue. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.